All right, I can probably go. Wait, where'd they go? They disappeared on me. Oh, there's someone, I think. Yeah, that's somebody. Let's go use the gate. All right. Use barn door. I don't think anyone's in the barn. Hey, pile. I can't even talk to Larry. That's awesome. Lee, oh my god, I'm so glad you two didn't get killed out there. Do you think Mark will be okay? Wish I knew, but I think he's in good hands now. Yeah? It's not too bad? He'll be fine. I've seen guys go through worse. Oh, shut up. How could you all bring us to this place? Yeah. I take it you and Kenny didn't exactly make up on the way here. I tried seeing things from his point of view, having a wife and kid and everything, but gambling with your family's life is pretty stupid if you ask me. Hey, thanks for backing me up this morning at the motel. I know I came down on you guys pretty hard, but you do agree with the way I'm running things, right? I don't know. I don't know, though. Both you and Kitty have been very important in keeping the group together. Yeah, well... If I don't keep us alive, there won't be a group to keep together. I guess. But if I'm not here, there would be no group either. So. Right, let's see if there's gotta be... What? what, what? Cornfield. Having a crop like that on hand must be great. We're gonna need to learn how to maintain it if we end up staying here. Mucho corn. Corn for days. What's in here? If there's not enough room in the house for all of us, I guess a few of us could camp out here in shifts. Yeah, that's not using the barn door at all, but okay. Anybody over here? Nope. Alright. Let's go on back. Okay. Uh, the kids are on the swing. I can probably check on Clement. Oh, jeez! Flying duck. Hey, Clem, do you like the swing? Yeah, it's fun. Thanks for fixing it. You're welcome. On will the best, you push me on it? Oh, of course I will. Sure. Happy to push you on the swing. Mind if Clementine takes a turn? All right, duck. Let Clementine have a try for a bit. Okay. Well, what was it with that the punching thing? How are you? How are you holding up, Clementine? I'm okay, I guess. Are you okay? If that's an option, I'm always gonna I'm ask that first. About Mark. Is Mark going to be okay? He got lucky out there. Could have been a lot worse. Are you going to find the people who hurt Mark? We have to make sure they don't hurt anyone else. Be careful. I want you to stay lucky, too. Ever since I met you, I've had good luck, so don't worry. Okay. What do you think of the dairy? It's pretty. It reminds me of how things used to look before. Yeah, it does. Do you think things will ever get back to how they were? Uh, yeah, let's say positive. I'm not sure when. One day, things have got to get back to normal. That's good. I hope it's soon. Yeah, me too. You gotta, you gotta keep the kid positive. All gotta right, keep the kid Clint, positive. Everyone else, I can be negative okay. and want to kill them. Me. Of course. But it's all yours. yeah. Okay, Doug, I'm not saying this place is safe. We friggin' dude just got shot with an arrow. Kenny, I swear to God, if your kid hits me, I'm gonna hurt him. Where am I going? Kenny, I swear to God, you hit me with that friggin' flying duck. Hey. Hey, Lee. Found anything interesting? I'm just trying to make sure this place is secure. In case we decide to make this a more long-term solution. Except for those people in the woods. Seems pretty safe. Good to know. Keep your ears open for anything else that might help us. How you holding up? I hope they feed us, Lee. Soon. On the way over here, I was getting dizzy. 
Hands shaking, cold sweats. Thought I was gonna pass out. They've got food here. Yeah, but I'm not just talking about one meal, you know? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Did Duck and Katja get here okay? Well, it wasn't easy. Duck didn't look so good on the walk over to this place. Uh, if everything works out, maybe he and Katja can have an easier life here. I hope you're right. Duck and Clementine deserve a better life than starving to death at some crappy motel. I guess, uh, Lily isn't too thrilled about being here? I could give two shits about what Lily wants. Duck and Katja need food, and I'm not about to sit around that motor inn and watch him go hungry. You're with me on this, right? Yeah, man. Yeah. I agree with you there. Lily's judgment is clouded, but you got a pretty clear head about these things. I'm gonna go have a look around. Don't wait too long to help scope out that bandit camp. It'd be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about the St. John's and their relationship with those bandits or whatever. Right. I'll see what I can find out. Right, right, right. Okay, well those two are up there. I don't know where Katja is. Or Carly. Oh no, Carly and Ben stayed back, that's right. Fellas? How you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. Yeah. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Let's go, man. Yeah. It'll be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about what we're up against. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. So we're taking a gun. Cool. Are you going now? Yeah. I'll be back soon, Clementine. Please be lucky. I will. How does he know where it is? There's a can. Alphabet soup. Here. See, I found it. You didn't find it. Oh shit. You found it? I'm gonna get my sneaky snake on. You see anybody? Nope. But stay ready, motherfucker. Stay on your guard. Watch my back, Lee. I'm gonna check out the tin. This camp's too small. It can't be their main base. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. I have a bunch of, uh, Empty. bottles. But it looks like someone's been eating out of these. Recently. Oh, boy. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Gasoline. Nothing but fumes. Damn. Oh, shit. Okay. Thank you. 
What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? Not unless you need a bunch of empty cans. <laughs> I'll pass. St. John's Dairy. Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. Why do you make it seem like there was even more back there? That I can't look at. Alright, whatever. We got the shopping cart. Mm. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. Uh huh. Just water. Hey man, water is important. Okay. Trash. This is kind of recon, so I'm gonna examine everything. I don't need that. All right. Never know what could have been in there. Nothing. Empty. What the hell is that? That's a camera? That's a weird looking camera. What do you find? A video camera. Let me see that. Battery's dead though. Oh, good. What else they got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then. Why do you say on. good? I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, huh? Sounds like she's running this democracy of yours. Not really. I'm not I'm not done looking at stuff. A bloody bunny. messed up man was more like what the fuck the hell? don't you fucking move oh shit shit put your guns down i ain't going back you tell him jolene ain't going back all right jolene hey we had a deal no shooting as long as we gave you food what the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Steal everything from me. Who are you, girl? Who the fuck are you? Oh, no need to curse, Lee, all right? <laughs> Look, it's not safe up here in the woods. You gotta come back to the dairy. <laughs> oh, it's a hell of a lot safer up here than down there, you best believe. Now, maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down! You think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice, sharp arrow right through your eyeball and into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take it Where'd you get the hat, girl? Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? A little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. What? What the hell are you talking about? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. String them up on that tree. 
Then I'm gonna head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person oh. I see. Put, Put down, down the crossbow, crossbow, girl. Come on. No, sir. I need it. I need it to kill you, fuckers. <laughs> well, shoot, shoot Go him. On. Tell him, boy. Don't shoot me. Tell him what you got in mind for. Oh. How may I assist you? God damn it! God damn it! You shot her. You straight up murdered that woman. Hardly. She had a crossbow pointed at my forehead. Actually, it was pointed at me, but. <sighs> it's a clean shot, though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. So, that's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. I doubt that. Take the crossbow. Tell him, be smart. There you go. Come on. I'm sorry, girl. I don't know who you are. 